to uh, clean up, right? So this is the left-hand cluster and that is the right-hand cluster, okay? So the back of the car is that way. So if you remove the uh, bulb holder, that was the picture of the conductor earlier on that we saw. But what is the problem? is isn't so much those conductors. They're quite thick and they don't get burnt out. What happens is uh, the back of the lamp holder are a row of pins. Now you can already see one corroded pin which is uh, second from the top there, which is badly corroded. And these pins are important because not only do they supply power to the bulbs, they also allow power to be supplied to the right-hand cluster via this harness here, right? So this harness um, terminates in a row of connectors. And the row of connectors goes in to, I would say, one half, I'll just show that to you, the one half of the socket. So you see the connections there made between the pins and the connector that goes to the right-hand cluster. And right from the front of the car, the harness then comes in from the front of the car and goes in to occupy the top half of the socket. So the power then comes from the front of the car via the main harness to go into the top half of the socket, makes contact with the pins supplying power to the bulb and then connects to the other connector that then goes to the right-hand cluster. So when you have problems with both either the right-hand side or the left-hand side, the main culprit are these uh, connectors out there, the pins, as well as this whole piggyback thing which is happening. So I would clean this uh, connector here. I would of course clean those pins there and then that should at least restore power from both to both the left-hand side and the right-hand cluster. Now, why does it get corroded? Well, it gets corroded because this particular uh, design of the lens has got a rubber seal here and there is a bit of a twist and a join here. And this, you can see here already, right? It is pretty bad. And so water comes in through here, uh, drops in through the lens and into the bulb holder. And then of course it corrodes uh, uh, everything else. So what you need to do is therefore clean up the uh, uh, the connector, the 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 row of pins, uh, the main uh, harness of course, as well as then seal and make sure that there's no water ingress uh, to the uh, lens.